Good day, fellas, and a welcome to the eighth episode of the From Scratch series on a Mythical PS. Has been a little bit. I did do a video yesterday on here, uh, but it has been a minute since I've actually done a um, From Scratch video on here. But I am excited to get back into it. There has been an insane update, so make sure you check out my previous video for that. And there's been a few other updates that I actually haven't been on for. Um, I believe it was two or three updates ago. Uh, they actually added collection log rewards to every single collection log in the game and that is a lot of uh different bosses on here like there's so many different bosses on this server because it's just been out for so long this is one of the longest running servers in the whole scene um but yeah make sure you enter the giveaway as well like the video comment your mythical username and be subscribed to the channel and uh yeah let's get right back into where we were Okay, so we are at the god boss right now. Um, I just wanted to scroll up. Make sure to check the drops. Too sick. Too sick looking bow there. Um, so yeah, this server's been around for so long, but uh, if you played servers back in the day, uh, it had funny dialogue with that and a lot of stuff. Um, this is obviously some really old uh, content that's been around since the start of the server, but it is a starter task. So we just need to do 25 of these. It won't take long at all. Um, but yeah, definitely some nostalgia from the old server still in this server, just because it's been overrunning for so long. Uh, I don't think he's going to drop anything too exciting. Um, we're just trying to finish off the last few starter tasks we need to do, and then basically the next step will be to um, try to keep upgrading this armor, this starter armor. The pet as well you can upgrade, but if we get to the point where we can do higher level bosses... Um, we might be able to start farming a set that's actually better as well. But we will see how it goes. So we finished that um, finished that boss. We actually got a uh, Ring of Riches. Um, it only gives 1% drop rate, so uh, we might use it. Um, it's probably, honestly, the best thing I've got at the moment. Um, but the main thing we did it is for the starter tasks. Definitely, if you're new to the server and you need to figure out what to do, this is a really good list of things to get through. I've pretty much finished everything now. I just have to open a burrow's chest and... I think that's pretty much it. Um, I've done everything else. Uh, I might have some tokens, but basically, I already bought the speed gloves. Definitely buy them after you do eight tasks, but you can still buy insanely OP keys or Krex loot crates. I think the Krex loot crates are the best. Uh, the armor is definitely better than the star gear if you get that from it. But um, yeah, nice gains. So we will be starting the achievement grind, uh, or continuing I should say. Uh, we were at 37 right now, see where we can end off. I think the first one I'm going to get done is the magic logs, um, wood cutting and burning. Uh, I want to get the rock tail ones, should be pretty easy as well. Uh, let's see if we can get like... I'm hoping to get to like 50 achievements done this episode, that's going to be the goal. 50 will put us uh, halfway, at least number-wise, but obviously the elite ones are going to take a lot longer than the um, medium ones. But you get like scratch cards, uh, which aren't bad, honestly, and um, you do need these. You need, do need to do these achievements, so I think we'll, we'll get a crack on these and try to get some progress. Really want to try to get at least 50 this episode total done. Alright, we are about to finish two achievements. Uh, we already finished Burn 100 Magic Logs. Um, the rewards are really actually quite nice getting these scratch cards. You can actually upgrade these as well. I'm wondering if that's smarter to do. Anyone that's uh, watching this that's uh, further on than me, let me know if it's worth upgrading the, um, the scratch cards. How many do you need actually? 15, that's tempting. Um... I wonder what it upgrades to. I'm not sure on the amounts on the scratch cards, but uh, see if we have any more. But I'm sure I can get way more from my achievements. Uh, my bank is absolutely doomed in terms of organization. Yeah, we don't have any. Um, I think I might keep these, but I'm just curious what it actually upgrades to. Uh, but we'll keep chipping away at these achievements. Um, I really want to get these easy ones out of the way. Uh, fighting another player, that's a bit... Uh, I, I mean, I'm, someone will definitely help. Uh, 
I assume you just have to go to Wildy. Um, but that one's going to be a little annoying. Otherwise, um, these ones are pretty chill. Runecraft, mix a potion. I might try and get these ones all done. Well, it's certainly been a minute or a few years since I've been to this place. But uh, I think that's all I have to do for that one. Yep. That was an easy achievement. So yeah, the full minigame. Actually, I remember doing this for money. Uh, these were worth so much. In the um, main game, but... Yeah, obviously I can't catch them here. I don't have the hunter level. But yeah, no, it's been so long since I've been in here. I, mean, I used to spend so much time in Pura Pura, man. Uh, but enough stalling. We are, I really want to try to get all these easy ones done if I can, besides the PvP one. So with the new uh, collection logs, um, basically you can go back to old bosses, because uh, well you can do the lower level, it's good to do the lower level bosses just for the rewards really. Um, but, I can find it. Shaman Defender, I believe. So I've just been grinding these. I did just get a Defender's Plate Body, uh, 182. And I do need these boss points as well to upgrade my gear. Um, I'm wondering if the Defender's Plate Body is probably pretty close to my armor I've got now. It's 2,500. Ooh. Armor's just a little bit better. Yeah, I might need to, I might should try and find a boss that's going to drop me some upgrades. But uh, yeah, it's, it's almost better than the armor I had. Um, I know for a fact that the defenders I'm doing right now, I need to do them for the... Um, it's like a cape, it drops, it would be better than what I've got, and a few other things, but the collection log's always nice. Um, still, we take those. So, for the tier 4 upgrade, I believe, the Asada armor set... Uh, you can right click it and see what you need, and I believe we went over the this thing last episode. Such a funny mini game. You definitely check that one out. Um, craziest mini game I've seen on RSPS. But the biggest grind for the set, I believe, is to unlock the turmoil upgrade from the boss point shop. Uh, now that I've got sort of AOE, a bit of AOE stuff, it's not as bad. I am able to AOE the bosses if, um, depending on the zone. But um, yeah, as you can see, I actually need to grind 500,000 uh, boss points. There's a good chance, um, a good chance I'll probably find a better upgrade than the starter armor by the time I get that many boss points. So I'm not sure if I should actually be trying to do that. Um, obviously, the boss points will come passively, but I think I'll probably be able to do a boss that drops better gear before that happens uh but we do want the turmoil upgrade regardless uh because it will help out count quite a lot i actually don't even have 95 prayer yet i might do that next that's probably a really i might try to get 99 prayer actually there is a ton of uh when it comes to this server just because it's um it's just so much so much content um but I wanted to get 99 prayer and I wanted to unlock turmoil. Uh, there's a really good guide I will link in the description, uh, starter guide on Discord. It just sort of gives you uh, the starter task I was doing earlier, but also he uh, sort of has his own list of stuff that he's made. But for prayer, basically what you can do is uh, colon colon DZ, as long as you've got regular Duna, which you can definitely get really easy starting out. Um, super easy to get the rank, uh, the regular donator rank. And uh, these otherworldly beings actually are really good. So check the drop table. Um, you can get 25 frost bones, 500 dragon bones, 50 frost bones, and a thousand. Uh, these are probably the best way to get the bones for prayer. I'm not sure how much XP the dragon ones will give, but I'm hoping it'll be enough. See how much these frost ones give. 66k. Yeah, no, we'll be. We should be able to get 99 off these. Be very nice to get another 99 to wrap up the episode. So to wrap up the episode, we will be getting 99 prayer. I've got 98 right now. This will definitely get me the last XP I need. There we go. 99 prayer. So very nice. Um, so we are good for that. I actually hadn't hadn't been using turmoil. 
Um, yeah, I, I wish I could be progressing a bit faster, but there's just so much to do. And um, but I think for next episode, I will be, I will really try and focus on these achievements, and uh, also just getting upgrades really. Um, camping those collection logs for boss points will get me those boss points I need as well. But yeah, really fun server. Definitely check it out. The actual last three or four updates, I did look at all of them. Uh, yeah, the owner has been smashing it with the content, actually. Um, there's just so much to this server that it is impossible to show all in a video. But um, it is very fun. And yeah, make sure you check the links in the description. Really, really nice community. Everyone's been super cool on here as well. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode. And yeah, take care, everybody.